clan leader wants to speak with you. Keep your running pet on a short leash. Get him the right soon or put him down. You know what's wrong with him. What he needs? There's nothing wrong with him. Just go speak to the clan leader. Erdnot clan reports use weak encryption. I see references to a captured Solarian in the logs of the chief scout. Also, I have been unable to access local medical records. I suggest asking the local clan leader for assistance with Grunt's problem. Were you around when the female camp sent the children over last week? No. I was off dealing with a Varen attack. What? Did he promise any warriors? Yes, of course. They're strong. But they didn't tear enemies apart. Counted 13 guards since we came in. They afraid someone's gonna invade this planet? These aren't guards. They're warriors. I know guards when I see them. This is the great Krogan homeworld. This is the land of Kredok, Shiagar, and Viol. This chunk of rock is barely worth standing on. Never thought I'd miss the tank. Halt. You must wait till the clan leader summons you. He is... in talks. You know what tradition demands. Clan Erdnot must respond. Your reforms will not go unopposed. You risk appearing weak at a critical time, Shepard. Good enough? Excuse me. <laughs> How do I... Shepard! My friend. You look well for dead, Shepard. Should have known the Void couldn't hold you. Looks like helping me destroy Saren and the Geth has worked out for you. Glad we didn't have to kill each other on Vermeer. Huh. You made the rise of Erd not possible. Vermeer was a turning point for the Krogan, though not everyone was happy about it. Destroying Saren's genophage cure freed us from his manipulation. I used that to spur the clans to unify under Erd not. You abandoned many traditions to get your way. Dangerous. Speak one spoken to, Uvenk. I'll drag your clan to glory whether it likes it or not. Now, Shepard, what brings you here? How's the Normandy? Destroyed in a collector surprise attack. I ended up spaced. Well, you look good. Ah, the benefits of a redundant nervous system. Yeah, humans don't have that. Oh, it must have been painful then. But you're standing here, and you've got a strong new ship. Takes me back to the old days. Us against the unknown, killing it with big guns. Good times. I have a Krogan on my crew. He has some kind of sickness and needs treatment. from, well, was your clan destroyed before you could learn what is expected of you? I have no clan. I was tank bred by Warlord Okir. My line distilled from Kredok, Moro, Shiagar. You recite Warlords, but you are the offspring of a syringe. I am pure Krogan. You should be in awe. Okir is a very old name. A very hated name. He is dead. Of course. You're with Shepard. How could he be alive? Does that name mean anything to you, Rex? Vicious warlord responsible for many deaths. Who apparently toyed with genetics. A clone undertaking the right. You are considering it? Tank bred allowed status as an adult? This is too far. There's nothing wrong with him. He's becoming a full adult. Puberty? Grunts growing up? I don't care what aliens call it. Krogan undergo the rite of passage. Too far, Rex. Your clan may rule, but this thing is not Krogan. Idiot. So, Grunt, do you wish to stand with Erdnot? 
What does the rite of passage require? Not for me to say, Shepard. The shaman will discuss that. This is his choice. in my blood. It is what I am for. Good boy. Speak with the shaman. He's over on the second level. Give him a good show and he'll set you on the path. You too, Shepard. How many times have you stepped in a mess for your crew, hmm? I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Watch yourself, Shepard. Tuchanka isn't safe and homey like Pharaohs and Ilos. You go beyond yourself, Gatata Uvank. The rights of Erdnot are dominant. How do we know it will challenge him? He's unnatural. The beasts of the right could ignore him like a lump of plastic. They know blood no matter the womb. Your barking does not help your case. I'll speak for myself. This is the tank bread. It is very lifelike. Smells correct as well. Your protests ring hollow, Uvank. Heard not Rex has given us permission to seek clan status for Grunt. Permission? Huh. That is good enough, if lacking in spirit. If this must stand on ritual, then I invoke a denial. My Grant stands against him. He has no one. Mm. My patience is tested, but Uvank invokes correctly. Grunt, who is your Krant? Your allies willing to kill and die on your behalf? We stand with Grunt as shipmates and comrades. Shipmates are not the same thing. But I grant you aliens your simple interpretation. Aliens don't know strength. My followers are true Krogan. Everything about Grunt is a lie. You... You dare. <laughs> I like this human. She understands. I withdraw my denial. This will be decided elsewhere. You have provoked them. Reason enough for me to like you. They're your problem now. Is that Krogan gonna be a problem? He is forbidden to interfere. Will he? During the Rite of Passage, you must be ready for anything, Shepard. From what you've shown me, you will not disappoint. We're ready. Let's do this. Excellent. This is Tachanka's most recent scar. The last surface city to fall in the rebellions. The Keystone was at the heart. It has survived wars in the passage of centuries. It endures. Like the Krogan. If you wish to join Clan Erdnot, you must contemplate the Keystone and its trials. What will happen? Who knows? You must adapt. You must thrive, no matter the situation. Any true Krogan will. Let's get started, Shepard. Hit the keystone. First the Krogan conquered Tuchanka, and mastered a natural world only we are fit to hold.
Genophage. Our reward, our curse. It is a fight where the only goal is survival. beyond my genes, which are damn good. This will cause discussion. I wonder... You say you are pure, no alien meddling in your construction, just the Warlord of Kyr. Best Krogan traits are distilled into Grunt. He's designed to be perfect. Being designed is the problem, but not me by the he is truly powerful. That is a tolerable loophole. For what? A reason to accept you. You are a mistake, but your potential could tip the current balance of the clans. You spit on my father's name, on Shepard's name, but now you stop ranting because I am strong. With restrictions. You could not breathe, so or serve on an alien ship. But you'd be clan in name. Talk like he's a thing. You're after his power. You don't really want him in your clan. Of course not. I didn't really want to cooperate with Clan Erdnot either, but I had to. Clan Gadotog is on the verge, either of greatness or of joining the dust. I get traditional support if I fight you, and reformer support if I back you. Your rite of passage tipped that balance too. It's your choice, Grunt. Sounds like an easy job. That's the problem. I'm pure Krogan. Uvik, you were the pretender. 
Your head is valuable whether you are alive or dead. Just try to take it. They've seen us. Right. Right. Try a real man's weapon. survive, but it has been years since a Thresher Maw fell. Your names shall live in glory. Grunt, you are Erdnacht. We now own property. Join the army and apply to serve under a Battlemaster. Shepard is my Battlemaster. She has no match. Understood. Congratulations, Erdnacht Grunt. Accept this token from Fortak. His weapons are the finest we have. I want to know about Tuchanka's past. Tuchanka is a place of great gifts. It kills the weak, torments the slow, and destroys the stupid. Survival is an honor, and here, Krogan thrive. We cover this planet with our civilization, only to burn it to the ground a dozen times over. Each time, we grow stronger. When we are wise and powerful enough, we will tame the planet forever. I've never heard anyone say that wiping out their own civilization was a good thing. I'd have thought you of all aliens would understand, Shepard. The Krogan empires and clans of the past were glorious, built in great battles and conquests, but their cores were weak. How else could they have fallen? When Krogan civilization achieves its apex, there will be no stopping it. No stopping us. Tell me about Krogan rites and ceremonies. You have seen the rite of passage. Krogan suffer the rite of life at birth, and the rite of honor when they wish to be considered for breeding. The rite of firsts is suffered before a Krogan faces a new enemy. A clan leader also undergoes many rites in service to the clan. What rites did you go through to become Chief Shaman? Becoming the Shaman is excruciating. I passed through rites that made me wish to die. I carry the scars on my soul. I must perform rites each dawn and dusk to keep me bound into our Krogan nature. Our spirit is one of violence and death. I must be attuned to that. Your job is awful. Indeed. What were you called before you became Shaman? I gave up my name when I became the Shaman. I am a conduit for the rage and bloodlust of my people. It would be wrong to retain my old identity. My life belongs to the clan. I should go. May your foes be strong enough to keep you sharp. 
Welcome, Erdnot Grunt. My name is Ratch. You and your Krant will find many items of interest in my store. The human is my battle master. Of course. There's not much here for humans, but you can take a look if you want. Everyone I talk to hates that aliens are in Erdnot. Except you. I don't have the luxury of turning away paying customers. I do enough business off-world to know that you aliens have more credits than people here do. What do you have in stock? Most of it's food and drink that's toxic to humans. Rincall's a local favorite. Don't try to act tough, it'll tear your insides apart. He's not joking. Rincall hits aliens like ground glass. Otherwise, I've got weapons, scrap, and whatever food those pie jocks don't steal. Which isn't much. Take a look at my kiosk over there if you want to buy something. What the hell is a pie jack? Off-world vermin. Humans say they're like monkeys. They come in and steal food, ring call, whatever they can get their talons on. We started using the mounted defense cannons to stop them. I'm a good shot. Maybe I can help out with the pie jacks. Feel free. You can use the console out there to control the guns. Make a dent in the pie jack population. You get a discount. Good luck with that. I should go. Suit yourself. Let's see what the human can do. Try this. <laughs> Looks like Gers finally found someone to follow around. <laughs> Seeing those vermin roasting in the heat from an explosive shell, I swear it was glorious. It was a lot of fun. But help yourself to more. There's no shortage of pie jocks out there if you get a craving for violence. I'll give you a discount at my store. Anything you want, you buy at cost. Welcome to the clan, or not grunt. Honored to be a part of it. Good for you. Now go find something else to do. Those fools brought this Tomka back from a skirmish without its combustion manifold. They say it got shot off in the field. You tell me, how can you expect a Tomka to run without a combustion manifold? I'm going out in the field. If I see a combustion manifold, I'll bring it back with me. If you did, it would save me a lot of work. Maybe bring back my sunny disposition. Let me get out of your way. Don't do me any favors. Could you be in here? As I understand it, Clan Erdnot has a new member. So, you're our new warrior. The Shaman gave you the customary upgrades, I assume. He's fast to pass off my work as his reward. Use them well. The Lord High Researcher for Clan Erdnot has no time to make replacements. But perhaps I can offer a discount. You must be working on something important. I was building the biggest, best offensive ordinance yet. A real ground pounder. But the new clan leader wastes my time with frivolous research. Crop genetics, medicinal improvements. We can buy that stuff from the Salarians. The Salarians? The designers of the Genophage. Yeah, yeah, what else can the Salarians do to us at this point? It's not like they can make us even more infertile. Actually, wait, forget I said anything. Sounds like the new clan leader has some very different ideas on how to lead the Krogan. If you want to know more, talk to him directly. 
He's my leader. I'll not say anything else about him. I take it you're a scientist. I used to be a scientist. I designed weapons. Now my genius is wasted on frivolous things. Things that don't explode. My predecessor said no one would understand the true worth of my work. As I pulled my blade from his chest, I knew he was telling the truth. Not exactly what I would call effective academic peer review. I don't care what you'd call it. We value the will to use what we create, not just the ability to create it. We don't count success until the ground shakes in response. Enjoy your research. Yes, yes, move along. You just can't help making trouble. No one has killed a maw since my turn in the right. Next you'll tell me he's a Clint and craps dark matter. Guess that's what it takes to replace me. You are Erdnot Grunt. Welcome. Sounds like you've got big changes ahead for the Krogan. We are making a neutral ground where all clans are welcome. Fertile females can be shared among clans. We will strengthen the race as a whole. It's what you showed me on Vermeer, Shepard. We're not just saving Krogan. We're saving who we are. What do the women of Clan Erd not think about this plan? It was our female clan leader's idea. The neutral area is safe, and it encourages more female clans to ally with us. Attacks on Erdnot now endanger the females of all clans. Even clans that want to see me dead will defend Clan Erdnot. Your women have their own clan structure? Nothing is more valuable than a fertile female. We know it. They know it. They isolate themselves for their own protection. We work together to set up breeding alliances. I can hardly do anything without Clan Leader Yuta's approval. How do you maintain security with so many different clans in one place? Any clan willing to send in hostages can come in. No fighting inside the camp. Each clan punishes its own criminals. We stop conflicts before anyone dies. Then we present a simple choice. Pay a fine and deal with your problems, or your clan is no longer welcome. That doesn't sound very harsh by Krogan standards. Allies from other clans like what I'm doing. They help deal with skeptics. Many are eager for an outlet. Every time I've declared a clan unwelcome, my allies have destroyed them. Word gets around. What's so important about maintaining individual clans? Every clan has different customs. Rites of passage, rules of behavior, battle songs, all unique. That diversity makes us great. No clan, not even mine, was meant to survive on its own. Erdnot is the leading clan. Doesn't that make your culture primary? For now. But every clan has its unique assets. The best tacticians are Erdnot. Chorgal has the longest breeding line. Gatatog holds the oldest settlement. Others have their own strengths. We keep going how we are. The clans will end up as craters under nuclear haze. Even or not, we need to rethink. Restart. This sounds ambitious. How's it gone so far? Better than I'd feared. Worse than I'd hoped. I've got a few clans. Too many are turning their backs on us entirely. Sounds like you're not making friends. Traditionalists like Uvenk are chained Varen, always fighting, guarding their pathetic stick in the ground. When the smoke clears, I can plant the flag on their corpses and rally the rest around a new Krogan hub. Sounds like you're counting on a lot of bloodshed even after you unite. It will be slow. But I won't change what we are. Krogan are judged by the strength of our enemies. Our worst insult is to say someone's not worth killing. I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Hunt well, Shepard. Erdnot clan reports use weak encryption. I see references to a captured Solarian in the logs of the Chief Scout. 
In addition, killing the Thresher Maw has produced several breeding requests for Grunt and one for Shepard. Ah! What did I tell you, honey? Isn't it beautiful? Far away from all that high-tech noise. I guess. Seems a bit dirty, though. Ah, oh, it builds character. Is it just me, or do the other Krogan not like me? Oh, there's some concern about me bringing in a non-Krogan. I had to talk to the Chief a little. It's not a deal. Wait, so they don't even want me here? Who cares what they want? I want you. That's all that matters. I don't know if I can do this, Char. Hey, now. My blue rose of Ilium always stands strong to reach toward the sun. Okay, I'll manage. Just no more poetry. I noticed the fish tank up in your cabin. If you'd like, I could feed your fish while you're away. I'd appreciate that, Kelly. It's my pleasure. Anyway, what's up? That'll be all. Good luck out there, Shepard. You know, Commander, I'm not real broke up that Rex isn't coming. I'm good with our current amount of headbutting. I'd say we're at headbutting capacity. This mission takes me back. I've done a lot of crazy things, but I never tried to take on a Thresher Moor on foot before. Standard operating procedure when you get a Thresher Moor is run the hell away. Pick up sticks, move the hell out. Krogan don't know any better, I guess. Still, hell of a fight. Erd not grunt. I like it. I have a clan. That makes me... It makes me want to fight, not just able to. At Uvink, I wanted to disembowel him, to tear out his spine like a trophy. Can you focus that on our real enemy, or do I have to lock you up for the ship's safety? I get it now. It's part of what I am. It was just delayed because of being tank-bred. Now that I know it's not an outside thing, and I have a place as a Krogan, I like it. Our enemies are in trouble, Shepard. And we better not run out of targets. There's no danger of that. They're practically lining up. Everyone gets a turn. Ha! <laughs> Wouldn't want it any other way. People are talking out there. And I hear it all. The word is that Garrus really likes you. I can never tell with Turians. I think you should go for it. A lot of people want to see you two together. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Definitely. Part of me still thinks we're crazy for even considering blowing off steam. But I want to try it with you. I want a few moments that are just for us before we throw ourselves into hell for the good of the galaxy. I want that too, Garrus. Glad to hear it. I'll do some, uh, research and figure out how to... You know, okay, that sounded bad.